Literacy is the vehicle for all forms of learning. How can we not give our absolute best knowledge to what will bring the potential out of children everywhere? In this moment in time, we are really on the cusp of a change from what would be called the print-driven brain to the digital reading brain. There are challenges and joyful achievements ahead of us, and there are threats. The child who is distracted is not going to read at the same level of focus and concentration as the child of the past. The average child is changing their attention 27 times an hour. Inside the brain, we have to ensure that that child learns how to focus at the most, at the deepest level they can to apply their knowledge to the text. To ensure that process is a very difficult balancing act. So we have as a society to understand what is happening with children who have what's called continuous partial attention. It's not that they can't learn to read very well indeed, but can they learn to read at the level that will give them and us their best concentrated forms of reading? All of us are affected, not only the children. How we read is as, as important as what we read. And so the future, I believe, for my reckoning of this balancing act that we are all in, every parent is in it as well as every child, is can we learn to provide a foundation for that child so that the formation of what I am calling deep reading is part of the transition and the knowledge that the child takes with them over their development so that they know when to read with depth and concentration and when to read just as you and I do every day, the most surface forms of reading. So that for me is the future of a biliterate brain, to know when to do what. But it has to be learned in the beginning for us to be able to switch back and forth. So it's a very important moment.